Queen Six is watching out for you tonight. Fed up and frustrated over street racing, several people who live and work in Northeast Portland are finally being heard. Now the city says it will crack down on illegal street racing. A proposed ordinance would create harsher penalties. Uh, Lindsay Nadrich joins us live is looking into what's being proposed. Lindsay. Well, deadly street racing events have been an ongoing issue here in Portland for years, but city officials say it's recently gotten worse. The latest event happening Sunday here at this intersection behind me. Here's video from that event. It shut down the intersection of Northeast MLK and Columbia for nearly three hours, blocking access to businesses and homes. On Monday, we told you Portland police knew about the event but didn't respond, saying the crowd was so large, officers and medical personnel did not enter the area. I spoke to one neighbor who lives nearby and heard fireworks and the screeching of tires. He says this happens often and usually no one does anything to stop it. There needs to be more police presence, which is something that we don't see. Um, when we call, when we used to call the police, the police kept basically giving, giving us the sense that they cannot do anything. And you said used to call, so do you not even call anymore because they no. don't come? No, we're not calling for anything. We're not, I'm not even calling for gunshots anymore. But it's not just neighbors concerned about safety. The North Portland Coalition for Safe Streets, which is made up of several businesses, has now written three letters to the city asking them to take action. They say people are afraid to come to work and are threatened, harassed, and put into dangerous situations because the street races are allowed to continue unchecked. That's why the city is now working on an ordinance that would make street racing a misdemeanor. I'll have much more on that coming up at 5. Reporting live, I'm Lindsay Nadworch, Coin 6 News.